The Pudong New Area in Shanghai is celebrating its 30th anniversary this year as an economic powerhouse and a leader in financial reforms. The financial center of Lu Jiazui in Pudong is a product of China's economic transformation. In 2015, Lu Jiazui was incorporated into the Shanghai Free Trade Zone, making it a testing ground for financial reform. Yang Chengxi reports. These are some of the tallest buildings in the world, and this area is called Lu Jiazui. It is a 32 square kilometer part of the Pudong District in Shanghai, home to about 6,000 financial companies. So this is the financial heart of China. The Lu Jiazui area was slated to become a financial zone when China decided to develop Pudong in 1990. Experts from five countries held a three-day meeting to come up with a roadmap for the area. It was the first time international consultation was involved in district planning in the People's Republic of China. Over the years, Lu Jiazui became home to China's financial infrastructures like stock and futures exchanges, and it has also been the testing ground of financial reform and opening up. In the 2018 and 19, our bank business has entered another stage, whereas we were granted with a license to underwrite Renminbi bond, first for the foreign issuers, and then second with the domestic issuers. Foreign institute has a chance to go into the asset management, has a chance to go into the securities and many others to have the full circle of the business to conduct in China. The asset management sector has attracted many foreign firms. Nine out of the world's top ten asset management firms have set up shop in Lu Jiazui. This year, China further opened the fund management sectors for foreign players by scrapping ownership limits and processing their applications for public fund licenses. Finance is a highly supervised industry. Many operations are yet to be fully opened. We, the Lu Jiazui Administrative Bureau, also serve as an intermediary, communicating the ideas of businesses on reforms to regulators. Since last year, fund managers are also seeing a wider range of investment options. With the launch of the Star Market in Shanghai, a new board launched last year with a registration-based listing system instead of approvals. Experts say this is more in tune with modern financial markets. The new framework will provide a more balance towards more. Professional, fundamental, research-driven investors、uh, move away from the more kind of speculative、uh, kind of spectrum of the other end. Our registration system, experts say, is more accommodating to innovation firms that may not have steady cash flows in the beginning. Shanghai Pudong-based Advanced Micro Fabrication Equipment China, or AMEC, was among the first 25 companies to list on July the 22nd, 2019, the first day the star market started trading. We need a huge amount of funding to build the infrastructure, expand production, and invest in research and development. We all know that developing high-tech equipment requires funding in billions of yuan. The company is now the first microprocessing equipment maker on the board whose market capitalization exceeds 14 billion U.S. dollars. The goal of reform is to let finance boost the growth of the real economy. Yang Chongxi, CGTN, Shanghai.